guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here I'm Kylie thank you so much for being here today today I thought I would bring you guys along in a self-care night I have been really putting this off and today's just one of those days where I think I need it the most so welcome to my self-care night I don't know how much I'm going to be able to get done because it's already eight o'clock on a work night, so meaning I have work tomorrow. I think I'm just going to do as much as I can and whatever I don't do tonight, I'll do another night, not a big deal. So I'm so excited to be showing you guys what I like to do for self-care. Maybe give you guys a few ideas so that you can do them yourselves because we all deserve a little self-care in our lives am i right ladies and gentlemen so let's get to it first order of business i might want to do a bath i was making a list called self-care so let me just bring that to you so on my list called self-care i have on the agenda bath and then i have paint nails my nails have been looking so bad i just have not paid any attention to them they're also very short i just could not be bothered to do anything to them so they need some help i want to read my book i've been reading a lot lately so i want to read tonight at some point with a glass of hot tea in my hand the next thing was tea so i'll combine those together um i want to do a face mask whether this is like a face mask that i put on to sleep in or whatever that may be i want to do a face mask and or like do just like nightly skincare so those can like go together i guess and then i want to wear like my favorite pjs i think that's kind of like considered self-care as well if you just like wear your favorite pjs you just feel better about yourself so i'm gonna show you guys what i consider to be my favorite pjs and then no distractions so i'm going to turn my phone on do not disturb and i am not going to be texting snapchatting going on instagram for the rest of the night and i'm just kind of going to have myself a night with my dog a night to myself a night with my bathtub and just kind of a night to decompress and a night where I don't have to worry about anything I think this is good it's really good to de-stress whenever you don't go on your phone or anything like that I generally don't like to go on my phone at night a lot I think it helps to have like no screen time so that is on my list for self-care again I don't know if I'm going to get to all of that but we're going to try so let's get into the self-care routine self-care vlog whatever this is and yeah let's get to it i'm excited let's just pamper ourselves Okay, and I am back from my bath, and let me know if you're like me and you need to always shower after you bath, but I always feel like I'm dirty sitting in my own filth. Maybe that's just me, but I always shower afterwards. So now I'm going to do my skincare. That was also on my list to do. So I'm going to put on my headband and do that. And my face may look red, I did kind of like my um, exfoliating thing in the shower, so if my cheeks look red, that may be why. So 
So my skin definitely needs some hydration after doing all of that, whatever I just did in the shower. But I wanted to just show you what I'm going to be doing tonight, nothing too crazy. So I'll just show you. I know nothing about skincare, so if this is wrong by any means, you can let me know. I won't be offended. So yeah. So um, the first thing I'm going to do, since I did just exfoliate like really rough, I have really sensitive skin. I'm going to use my hyaluronic acid. I got this in a FabFitFun box. It's almost gone. After I'm done with this, I am going to get, I think, the Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid. I've heard a lot of good things about that one. If you know of a better one, you can definitely let me know. I do not like the way that this one comes out. I don't know if you saw that. It, it might have been off camera, but it squirts everywhere. So I like to take this and just pat it into my skin. And what I've heard about, like if you're gonna use serums or anything like that is you're supposed to take like the lightest things and then work your way up. So I like to just pat this into my skin. And like I said, I am not an expert. So don't follow my regimen because I know nothing. So yeah, pat, pat, pat away. Okay, then this is also what I think is kind of light. It's a watermelon glow sleeping mask by the Glow Recipe. And this smells wonderful. It smells like watermelons. So this is kind of like a gel res recipe. It's like a gel texture. And I don't use this every night, but on my self-care nights, I like to use it. And I just like to tap it into my face. So I'm going to do that. On nights like this, whenever I use this, I use this in place of my normal moisturizers. And then I like to use an eye serum because I'm not getting any younger. So at nighttime, I like to use the Algenis complete eye renewal balm and this one is thicker than the one I like to use in the morning so I like to just use this one at night and then this is what it looks like and it's kind of cooling too so it feels nice and I've heard it's important to get like above your eyes too not just under and I like to take my ring fingers because I heard that is your like lightest finger and then I just like lightly go underneath my eyes and I've been using this for a while and it doesn't look like I've used a lot but I swear I use this and then I like to just finish that all off with my Laneige sleeping mask I use this all the time, morning, night, during the day, and then I'll just put it on my lips. And I started with the berry one, but I prefer the vanilla one. I think it just smells better. I'm more of a vanilla person. I highly recommend this one over like the berry one, the pink one. Yeah, so that's pretty much it for my skincare for like my self-care night. I don't think I'm gonna do my nails tonight. It's like nine o'clock now. So I'm probably just going to wind down and let's see what else is on the list to do. Okay, so bath we can check off. Skincare we can check off. No distractions, we're not going on my phone tonight. Favorite PJs. So we have to get dressed and then we'll go downstairs, we'll make some tea and then we'll come upstairs and we'll read a book and then we'll call it a night. Doesn't that sound lovely? <laughs> Maybe only for me, but yeah. Okay, let's go make some tea and, oh, but first we have to change. I've been in my comfy robe. My grandma actually got me this robe and it's pretty comfy, but yes, let's change and then we'll make some tea. Okay, we are dressed, ready to take on the night. I am going to head down to the kitchen. Oh, it's dark now and make some tea. So let's go. Oh wait, 
I wanted to show you something. How cute is she? Hello, lady. Hello. I'll be right back. I'll be right back to join you. No, you stay. You stay. Okay, so I just made it upstairs. I just pulled up my book. I am currently reading Normal People. If you're interested in what I'm reading, you can keep up with me on Goodreads. That's where you can keep like the most up to date with what I'm currently reading. I'll link my Goodreads down below. I just brought my tea upstairs and I also made a Smart Pop bag of popcorn. It makes about this much. When I'm not feeling like making a like bowl of like the kernels of popcorn i don't know if you've seen my like weekend vlog where i make my own popcorn i'll like make one of these smart pop bags it's like super easy i do prefer to make my own popcorn um this is just like buttered popcorn but like when it's just me eating popcorn it's just a lot easier to make like a smaller portion bag or whatever and when i'm in a hurry so i just made this for a little snack and i have my tea i chose the sleepy time tea so i can like wind down i like sleepy time teas at night i like the detox teas the ginger teas. I just love ginger, so I really like the flavor. I also like to drink that when my stomach's upset. Yeah, those are like the teas that I like to drink at night. So I'm going to go read some and then I'll check in with you guys to end off the video in a little bit. I'm going to go read. I just started this book yesterday. I did just finish two books recently. I finished Untamed and I finished The Silent Patient. So I did just start this. So, I'm gonna go read and I will check back in a bit. Okay, you guys, I'm going to end this video off here before I get too tired. I just wanna highlight how important it is to give yourself some self-care. And I don't remember if I talked about these PJs or not. These are my favorite PJs. They make me feel comfortable. They make me feel just happy because they're tie-dye. I don't know, just like the colors make me feel happy and everything like that. But yeah, I wanted to highlight how important it is for you to do self-care, whether that's a face mask, whether that's reading, whether that's not going on your phone or whatever that may be for you. You don't have to do all of this, just do one thing for yourself. It doesn't have to be like a designated self-care night. I know I did a self-care night tonight and that's just because I wanted to. You don't have to do a whole night by all means. I just think self-care is important. It's one of my New Year's resolutions to just do self-care more. So I'm just trying to do that, to take care of myself. I just wanted to end this video off. I wanted to say I'm very thankful for 
all of you watching today's video. It really means a lot to me and if you're not already subscribed, be sure to hit that button down below. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and make sure you have those post notifications turned on and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!